my gender reveals today, but I'm just gonna do a quick unboxing right now. And I saw there was, I was almost gonna say Halloween, a high school musical collection. I was like, I know I have to get this. Oh, what does that say? Okay. So East High, is this the palette? Oh, it just, it looks kind of like a yearbook. Okay, so let's open it up. Oh wow, the shades are big too. And normally color pop kind of has like a bit smaller pans, which I don't, doesn't matter, but these are pretty big. Look at these. Okay, and then it comes with Showbiz, which is cream gel liner. Okay, so it looks like there's white, <laughs> annoying as hell. <laughs> this is still nice shades. Um, these are lip tints. Which anytime I want to tint my lip, I literally just do chapstick and lipstick. So I was like, oh, it'll actually be nice to get like an actual lip tint. Okay, so we kind of have like a, a mauve. Should we, let's swatch them too. So I'm excited about that. This is really fun. Pop and lock it's called. I haven't said any of the names, but. And then this one. It looks red, but I'm gonna say it's probably gonna show up more pink. Yeah, it's like a pinky red. Okay, and then the last things we got are, I believe, blush. Pressed powder blush, I do believe it is. Packaging again. Really nice, I love this. Hey, my face is disgusting because I'm breaking out because I'm having a baby. So everybody now knows that I'm having a girl because I posted my gender reveal. Exciting. I did not think I would be having a girl, but I love my little baby bump and I'm wearing this um, nightgown I got today. That's like really fancy. And um, we're gonna fix our hair afterwards. Okay, but. And I think we wanna do bold colors because we always do bold colors. I feel like it's lame to test out a palette and not do bold colors. And so because of that, wow, this is, it's a fairly bold palette. Um, but these are the colors, oh, that's a beautiful shade of purple too. Um, but these are the colors that are really sticking out to me right now. So I was thinking these two would be really cute, but also Gabrielle and Troy would be really cute. And then I was also thinking Gabrielle and Sharpay. I kind of want to use this as a base no matter what, but I was like, what would look best with it? I think this would look very cute, but I have been doing a lot of green and green lately. So maybe let's do Gabrielle and Troy and keep it family. I have a, I wanted to use that like deep berry blush, I think. I kind of wanted to go out of my comfort zone. Is that one? No. I should probably give that away. This one I think it was, right? This is like a nice deep berry. Okay, so let's go in with Gabriella. Hoping these shades are as beautiful as they look. And it's like really glistening. Well, that looks exactly like I hoped it would. Um, in terms of my pregnancy, is anything getting better? Not completely yet, honestly. I still throw up a good amount. I get sick a good amount. Oh shoot, there's that hair in my eye. This is like the perfect like deep peach shade. I really like it. Man, I really wish I had other stuff to talk about, but I don't. I do want to dye my hair again, but... Oh yeah, also you can see all the green faded out. Um, but I'm trying to revive health back into it, and I'm gonna try to like uh, take some like gummy prenatals, because all my other prenatals I haven't been able to really take. Um, and I'm hoping if I take some like good tasting gummy ones, I can like keep it down. I just, um... Like I haven't dyed it for a long time now, or like, not dyed it, sorry. I haven't like bleached it for a long time now. And so like the next time I bleach it, like I would like to wait months in between each bleach. Why did I say bleach like that? In between each bleach, well. Sorry, I'm in there. Where is, is there fabric stuff? I thought they just bought some, but I don't see any. I am so the wrong person to ask. Okay. I think I'm gonna use my X Mondo. Oh, by the way, I'll link it in the description because you can get 15% off with my affiliate code. After I uh, did my Brad Mondo video, um, 
not did my brand mono video. Jesus Christ, I'm sorry. Never talk to a pregnant person. It's like talking to like a brick wall. Um, but when after Brad reacted to my video, um, they messaged me and asked me to be an affiliate, and I was like, holy shit, yeah. So you can get 15% off, and I can get 15% off using my own code. <laughs> But I'll link it in the description. Um, and if you want to see me use it, yeah, I have several videos of me using it on this channel. Really, really good hair dye. I do recommend pre-lightening your hair though. Because it just gets you the best results each time, like honestly. Because I dyed it one time over brown hair and it's... And after that, I can leave it purple for a while. And I don't have to keep damaging it and I can keep going back brown. I mean, I have a kid on the way, so I'm not going to be bleaching my hair left and right. I went on my hair rant. I used to, now we're going to go on with this, by the way. Troy. Troy and Grab, Grabriette. I want to, like, work even more for them in the future, like, do maybe social media, like, marketing stuff. I have kind of been thinking about a marketing degree, too, but I'm kind of putting it on hold because of the baby. But... I don't know. There's a million opportunities in life. I'm loving these colors. They're beautiful. Okay, um, now I did some contour and now it's time to dip into our blush and see if we're fucking with it. Um, I don't know why I always have the urge to smell things. Um, Colourpop is known for being very pigmented, so I'm going to lightly dip into this. Because I don't want to wear power, but let's see. It blends right in, wow. Um, I also have some sits down here and I did not wear foundation, so you will see those up close. Um, and I think I'm gonna go back in with Twinkle Town to highlight because it is such a gorgeous shade. Okay, now let's do a tint, shall we? I get rabbit hairs all over me. Okay, I said I would like this color the most, but should we try something like this? And I don't know if like overlining will look good with a tint. Okay, so let's try this. I kind of do like to overline a little bit though, take it like a... This is 100% scented. Nobody can tell me different. It literally smells like juice. I love it so much. I love it. Okay guys, all, all fun, but this turned out really, really amazing. I love this look. I love the colors. Sometimes when you get colors, they can look very different in pictures or on camera and even in person and then you put them on your eyelids and they look like very different. But these shades are just absolutely gorgeous. I'm obsessed with them. Like I love the peach shade and the blue just came out so intensely and I love the highlight and the tint. I think tinted, like, is it, what is it called? Tinted, it's not lipstick, right? It's called, this is called cello and it just says lip crayon. I think it's like one of my new favorite things. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Chicken Queen, this is Life, I'm gonna have a good breakfast. Bye.